Hi and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to teach you how to remove your iCloud for, from your iPhone, okay, without knowing the password. For this, you're going to need a jailbroken phone. In this case, this is a very old iPhone 4. And yes, I have it jailbroken in 2020. Okay, it is still possible I have a video on my YouTube channel teaching you how to jailbreak your old iPhone 4 in 2020. Okay, once you have the jailbroken phone, you need access to Cydia. I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk about it in a second. Okay, this process doesn't work when you have your phone locked into that white screen asking for your username and password. It is not going to work if you have a phone like that. Don't even try because I cannot help you if you if, if you have that situation, okay? It only works if you have access to your phone. Only works if you can have at least the password from your lock screen. And you can uh, have complete access to your phone, but you really want to get rid of your iCloud account on your phone, okay? Once you tried it and you can remember the password, you're gonna need Cydia. Remembering you can only get Cydia when you have a jailbroken phone. You cannot find Cydia on your app store. You need a jailbroken phone to have Cydia, okay? Open Cydia. Wait a few seconds. Then go to search. You will need a tweak, an app called Filza. Okay, F I L Z A. Fill the file manager, click it, and then you will see instead of modify, you you will see install, you click it and click confirm. You're going to see a black screen and a lot of codes running, and after a couple minutes, it's going to be ready to use, and you're going to have the Filza icon on your, on your home screen, okay? You need to type, uh, <laughs> sorry, you need to tap that, run Filza, and then type back on the library, back on mobile, back on var, because I, I, I was browsing, you, you probably reach, reach these uh, slash, which means the root directory, you go to uh, var, search for mobile, where is it, okay, here, library, accounts, here you will see three files. Tap and hold one of them. Sorry. Select the three files and hit trash. Okay. These are the files that have your iCloud information. Okay. Once you've done that, restart your phone. And after your phone has restarted, you can go to the settings, restarting, okay now once your phone has restarted, you can go to settings and iCloud and there you have it, completely green and ready to, to enter a new iCloud account. But there's one thing I need to mention. This information you just took away from your phone, it is just illusionary, okay? Once you've done that, do not, I repeat, do not restore your phone. Because that will make your phone break. And um, you cannot use it because it will ask that account on your phone. Okay, I repeat, do not restore your phone, do not connect to your iTunes and restore in DFU mode, just simply do not restore. Once you have access to your phone, you're ready to, to, insert, to insert your new iCloud data here. And if you're selling this old piece of junk, <laughs> you, can just, um, you can just sell it this way because it will take some time for Apple to update this uh, that this phone is now linked to that new account okay it takes some time since the 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 account information that you have on this phone 
does not stay on this phone, okay? That information is just for you to keep on this phone, okay? How can I say? Just, um, just for the phone to recognize that it is linked to that account we just removed. So this will not update Apple servers, Apple's database. It will not clean your phone from your iCloud. So that's the reason you cannot restore it. Okay? It will take some time for it to understand that it's now linked. That IMEI, that IMEI, I don't know how to pronounce that, IMEI, is now linked to your new account. Okay? It will take some time, like probably a month or two, but I wouldn't restore the phone for security reasons or it will just turn into a paperweight. <laughs> okay? So that's pretty much for today and thank you for watching and for, don't forget to hit the thumbs up button, hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell so you can stay tuned for more videos. Okay, thanks for watching. Sorry for my English, I'm from Brazil. Bye-bye. <laughs>